You can't say it's the last luxury one because you don't know what our next deployment could be. It could be another Afghanistan. We don't know. Now, you could say, oh, well, it'd be drones and stuff. Well, yeah, but look at the, look, look at the, look at our counter IED, how that came on over the years. Are you telling me that there's not loads of stuff going in right now to counter drones and stuff? It, what we, we are not what we were, but we are still a, like, relatively ahead of the curve when it comes to technology and that kind of thing. Also, we're probably not going to war unless it's with America. So the chances are we are all going to have air superiority, at least for the foreseeable future. You know, like the American air power compared to Russia, they're not a fucking competition. You know, I mean, and then you're talking about the entire, like, like let's just say it was, let's, let, let's just say for sake of argument, there was a war, Russia, Russia versus NATO, no nuclear weapons. There's not a fucking, like, Ukraine are holding their own and doing a fucking incredible job about it. And I, you know, I admire the fuck out of the Ukrainian soldier and I hate that they're going through what they're going through. Um, but, you know, we, we are, like, we, we, if you look back at a lot of Britain's wars, we have always had the superior technology. We have, you know, we have had a lot of times the better training compared to the other side. We've had the, you know, better medical and that kind of thing over recent history. And there's nothing to say that the next thing we went into wouldn't be exactly the same. It might be even less kinetic than something like Afghanistan. So I don't think you can say it was the last quote unquote luxury war. I'd certainly think you can say, I'd rather be in, in Afghanistan than Ukraine. So that side of it, I totally get. And I think you can also say, if we went into a war against a near peer nation, it would be a lot higher casualties. You're going to be on the end of a lot more artillery. You might have a day when you when the enemy air, sh air does does turn up. All that is fine, but you know it's it's, it's this idea that from now on every war is going to be a mass bloodbath and stuff. It's just it's just not true. Mm.